Welcome to Buck Wild Hummer Tours. This is where you're gonna drive up, park your vehicle, and then you're gonna see, this is where all the buses, the airplanes, and the helicopters, this is where all the guests are going to meet us. You're going to walk over to the side of the building. All the guests will be passed on to you. Then you're going to take them over to the Hummer, introduce yourself and let them introduce themselves, and you'll start your safety spill from there. Okay, we have all our guests on board. At this point is where I want you to talk about Buckwild Hummer Tours, how it got started through the Halverson family. Ellen Halverson uh, is the star of the family. He started with one helicopter. We're going to share that story and then how they expanded into one of the largest tour companies in the world through helicopters, planes, and buses. At that point, you're going to continue on and then you're going to talk about how Ellen Halverson laid 13 and a half miles of pipe and helped the Grand Canyon Village and Tucson to have water. We'll stop here. All right, this is where we're going to enter into our little wonderful tourist town of Tucson. This is where I want you guys to take your time and talk about a little bit about all the little businesses like the lodging, um, of course the restaurants, the gift stores, and some of the fun things they do in this town. And how uh, the employees have lodging behind some of the hotels. And as you're entering uh, towards uh, McDonald's, make sure that uh, you make them aware that they might get sticker shock. It's one of the most expensive McDonald's in the world, and that's due because of the water. And as you're traveling along on the left-hand side, you'll see the IMAX. And of course, make sure you point out where Buck Wild Adventures is on the right-hand side coming up here shortly. This is where, uh, have some fun with this. And then as we're going along, I'll give you the next little segment of what I'm expecting you to stay on the tour. Thanks. All right, this is a fun little road before you're entering into the Grand Canyon. This is where I want you guys to uh, build up where they're going, um, talk about the trees, uh, and then uh, bounce back and forth with some facts of uh, you know how many visitors do they think the Grand Canyon has. This is a real good time to interact with your guests and uh, get them behind you. Before you enter into the gate, make sure that you uh, tell the story about Teddy Roosevelt. And of course, support our park rangers and what they do into the park. Because I think that's really important that we cover that because they, they're, uh, they're the reason why that we can enter into this park. As you're entering into the gate here, uh, they're gonna ask you to uh, pull out your CUA permit. You just pull that out. And then they're gonna have you move forward Okay, you uh, turned in your CUA permit. Now this road right here is really fun. You're building up the Yavapai Point as we're going to it. And make sure that you point out Buckwild uh, Hummer Tours. What we're out to do is spotting animals. This is a, a elk is gonna be one of your key things that you're gonna share information about. How they shed their uh, antlers once a year. How they grow back, the size of the elk, how far they should stay away. And then of course, talk about the endangered species, the California condor, be on the lookout for that, the bald eagle, and how the migration of the birds come to visit the Grand Canyon once a year, or twice a year, excuse me, and tell them about how that happens. And you know, they're just like the visitors that come from all over the world to see the Grand Canyon. Now you're gonna stop right here, continue going straight, Okay, we're getting close to our destination, Yavapai Point. We're gonna be uh, going to a stop sign here in just a second. You're gonna see on the right hand side, this is where the visiting center, the marketplace entry is. Make sure you give them a little bit of facts about, you know, this is where they get their groceries and get information about the Grand Canyon at this time. As you're traveling down this road, I want you to take a moment out and tell them how important this point that we're going to Yavapai Point is, that all the geologists actually came through here in the 1800s and the 1900s to get all their information about the Grand Canyon. This was the prime spot. So important to build this up. Now as we're coming along here, we're gonna be turning into the parking lot here shortly. We're gonna tell them some more stories. I'm gonna stop right here. 
Okay, you're going to be uh, coming up to the sign that gives us the turn off to Yavapai Point and the Geology Museum. This is where you're going to make a right right here. And when you're going into the parking lot, understand there's a lot of people that's going to go be pulling in and out all, at times. Be very careful. Make sure you are aware of your surroundings. And you will find an opening. You might have to do a couple of loops. Um, just be patient. Uh, make sure you get parked here. Because this is where you're going to conduct most of your tour. You'll bring, uh, you'll stop over by the restrooms. I will show you that hands on and I'll give you a little bit of a description as we're going along here. Just be patient right here. Make sure you get a nice parking spot so that you can conduct your full tour at this time. Okay, you're gonna be going around this corner here. You'll see the restrooms on the right hand side, easy access. This is where you'll take uh, time for people if they need to use the restrooms. You can start conducting your tour and talking about some of the trees, the yucca cactuses. And now on the path there, there's some uh, limestone rocks that have some fossils. Um, you can share that with people. And this is where you're gonna start your main tour at this point. Okay, we're gonna walk to the end of the path here. Tell them to close their eyes for a moment, take a deep breath, open their eyes, and take in the spirit of the canyon. Let them have a moment here to enjoy the peace and quiet of the canyon for a minute before you start talking. We'll continue on with the tour here in just a second. Okay, now you're going to take him inside the Geology Museum. You can spend uh, 10 to 15 minutes here depending on you know their interest. There's some great views. Um, it gives them all the history of the geologists that um, went through here, some cool facts. Right over here you're going to see a little map. You can show them the 277 miles from uh, Hoover Dam to uh, uh, Lee's Ferry. Um, and then at this point, um, you're just going to stay here for a few minutes. I'm just going to show you an overview of the museum and then you can continue on with the tour. So we just got done uh, being inside the museum there. You're going to walk them outside. This is a great part of the tour. I really love this part. Um, as you're walking down, there's some great uh, views, some great places to take pictures. You're going to have some of the stories that I'm going to give you on the actual tour. I'll be taking you out to this site. I'll show you uh, where you can talk about uh, John Wesley Powell, uh, Georgie White, of course, um, the Fred Harvey Company, Mary Jane Coulter, and there'll be a few other stories that we'll be telling and some cool facts from the Bright Angel Trail. Um, you'll show them where Phantom Ranch is. You'll show them the river, the bridges. There's a lot of uh, great spots that you can see all this and you can uh, tell the story. And then you can interact with your guests, of course. So this is just a quick overview of how this tour is going to work. I'm actually going to be hands-on to show you how this works. This is kind of help you um, if you have any questions regarding the tour so you can kind of get a general layout of the land. And look forward to uh, continuing on this training. Thank you. Remember, Buck Wild Adventures. Live the adventure. Love the adventure.